Next game on the list, according to Bavada, the Washington Redskins, uh, plus 13 at the Green Bay Packers. Um, this is an interesting one. My computers are split. Brad is taking Green Bay to cover. I'm taking Washington to cover. I projected a 28-16 to 16 game. That gives you uh, 16 plus 13 is 29 and a one-point cover. I don't love it. I'm not going to bet it. Take it off your board. Um, 13 points is way too much to give, I think, in, in general. Uh, Washington Redskins scoring 14.4 points per game, basically two touchdowns. That's so bad. 32nd in the league. Uh, Miami has uh, passed them. Denver has passed them. Uh, Cincinnati has passed them in terms of points scored. Wow. Uh, uh, they give up, by the way, uh, 24.2 points per game. Uh, that's not bad, but it's uh, when you're only scoring 14 points per game, that's no good. Uh, Green Bay, meanwhile, scoring 24 points a game and giving up 21. Um, interesting that uh, a team with as good of a record as the Green Bay Packers only have a net uh, point differential of about point, or I'm sorry, three points per game. Hmm, you know. Interesting. If you watch my deep dive against the San Francisco 49ers, um, you know, we talked about this in the show. We kind of saw it coming. But I think this is a safe victory for the Green Bay Packers. Um, thankfully for the Packers, they got to play the Giants and the Redskins back to back. Um, uh, but yeah, 13 is too much for me to lay. It's probably too much for uh, Brad to lay too. Um, I'm just taking this off my betting board. I, I suggest you all do the same. Uh, quarterback, nothing. Dwayne Haskins, no. Uh, Darius Geis is a yes, uh, just based on volume. Terry McLaurin is a fringe yes, but you have to be crossing your fingers and, uh, you know, you're going to be sweating it out with Terry McLaurin. The good thing, though, is Terry McLaurin does create separation. How many times is uh, is Dwayne Haskins going to miss him in the end zone? I don't know. I've already seen three. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Now, Green Bay, um, Aaron Rodgers is a definite start. Aaron Jones, uh, Jamal Williams, Devontae Adams is definite, are all definite starts. I don't like anybody else for Green Bay. Keep an eye out for Alan Lazard, who I've been talking about for weeks. I think he is definitely the second best uh, receiver on this team. Um, I was talking about Houston before. Houston is a different team when they have Will Fuller to help complement DeAndre Hopkins and take some of that coverage pressure off. Devontae Adams needs that as well. Alan Lazard was able to provide that spark against the Giants. I hope for Green Bay's sake that they can keep it going um, because they need a second receiver to be a Super Bowl threat. They need it, and I think Alan Lazard can be that guy.